good morning good afternoon and good evening everyone today i got redmi 9 the global variant and this device was launched also in india with the name of redmi 9 prime so the good news is the miui 13 having android version 12 is released for the redmi 9 global and uh, also the indonesian rom uh, for redmi 9 having stock me dialer with call recording and uh, stock me sms application also released for the redmi 9 and also you can flash this rom on any variant of redmi 9 let me remind you that the code name is Lancelot. So today I will show how to flash the Indonesian ROM on Redmi 9, the global variant. And uh, after that, we will get the stock me dialer having a call recording. And the version that currently I have on my phone is MIUI 12.5.6 having Android version 11. So my set will get updated from MIUI 12.5.6 from global to indonesia region rom having uh, android version 12 and miui version 13.0.21 let's start the video then do not forget to subscribe my channel also tap the bell icon and also select all thank you so much for doing that so before starting the video your mobile phone bootloader must be unlocked if you don't know how to unlock the bootloader you can instantly unlock the bootloader of your redmi 9 or redmi 9 prime by watching the tutorial video of how to unlock the bootloader of mediatek device redmi 9 instantly and uh, that video link is provided in my video description my mobile phone bootloader is already unlocked and now the most important thing is to save all the internal storage data this procedure will format everything check the mobile battery should be charged to maximum like 50 to 60 percent and uh, go to settings in case if you are using me account sync your me account once and then remove it same way go to account sync sync your google account once and then remove it doesn't matter if your mobile phone is having any version of miui 12.5 but your set must have android version 11 doesn't matter if your mobile phone is having any region of miui version the indonesia miui 13 the stock global rom will get flash on any region but the set must have android version 11 right i will power off the mobile phone and uh, this procedure requires data cable and computer so i have provided the links in my video description you simply uh, go to the description of this video and uh, download these two files this is the recovery file for redmi 9 and redmi 9 prime and this is the indonesia region rom the miui 13.0.1 and white version 12 so after downloading these two files just extract the redmi 9 twrp recovery file in same folder when it is done then open the extracted folder of the recovery file now come back to towards the mobile phone mobile phone must be power off we need to boot the set into fast boot mode for that hold the press and hold the volume down key uh, check the other side of this cable must be connected with computer then connect the cable with mobile phone and in few seconds the mobile will boot into fast boot mode then immediately release the volume down key set booted into fast boot mode you can see that i have uh, released the volume down key now uh, set is booted into fast boot mode and connected it with computer now coming back towards my computer screen so just double click the flash one file the recovery custom recovery flashing will start and the window will get auto close after when it is done then double click the flash two file yes this is also flash done and then double click the flash 3 file the set will get reboot immediately press the volume up key for few seconds the twrp recovery screen will get appears then release the volume up key immediately when you see team win recovery screen on your mobile phone the set when booted into custom uh, recovery the internal storage will pop up on your computer screen if you double click the internal storage the all the folders will not be in proper form uh, will not having a proper names if you can see that so basically the storage got encrypted 
we have to decrypt the storage first and for that come back towards the mobile phone screen tap wipe then tap format data type y e s then tap here and when it is done then tap back come back to the main screen tap reboot and tap recovery let the set boot into custom recovery once again so set boot it back into custom recovery this time the internal storage will uh, pop up once again and if you double click the internal storage the twrp only the folder you can see on your mobile phone or on your computer screen now come to the downloaded folder on your computer screen go back to the main downloaded folder and copy the indonesia miui 13 rom file from the computer hard drive and come to the internal storage of your redmi 9 and paste that file on the internal storage of your mobile phone and when file gets copied we are done from the computer disconnect the cable from mobile phone and uh, you can switch off the computer right now come back towards the mobile phone screen press the power button and then swipe to unlock the custom recovery screen first of all tap settings then tap the third menu and make the brightness to bring it to maximum the screen timeout and brightness okay come back to the main screen then tap wipe and tap advanced wipe select the delvic data and then data and cache that's all these three partitions need to be select that's all and then swipe to start wiping the things when it is done then come back to the main screen and then tap install and you will definitely see the indonesian rom that we just copied tap to select the rom file and then swipe to start flashing the flashing will get started uh, which will take little bit time so now wait because this is android version 12 which will take a little bit time when flashing get completed then i will continue and when you see flashing got completed then simply tap reboot system and set will reboot will show me logo and will be stuck for few seconds on this me logo and then will start booting into indonesia region rom the stock rom uh, of me y13 having a white version 12. so finally the first boot got completed and which took only like uh, 1.5 minutes i will complete my setup screen of me y13 the indonesian rom got flashed perfectly after setup screen definitely you will see me dialer on your mobile phone screen which means that we are having a me dialer with call recording i will tap the me dialer to show more about it and if i go further of uh, me dialer settings here we go we got call recording if you want you can uh, record it automatically automatically all the calls and if you want you can record calls manually by tapping the record button or like uh, making a call or during conversation so we are having a me dialer plus me sms application on the, this rom and if i go further to settings let me show the control center now the control center is got change we are having a new control center uh, with the me y13 version and this is the about phone screen of my uh, redmi 9 the miui 13.0.1 miui version and white version 12 you can see that and also if you see the brackets id id stand for indonesian region rom if i tap all specs if i go further you can see the all specification of my mobile phone check the baseband numbers definitely you will see the baseband number if if you cannot see the numbers with the baseband which means that there is some problem but hopefully the numbers will be there so this is how we can flash the stock indonesian region rom on redmi 9 any variant or redmi 9 prime and we can get the me dialer and me sms application call recording and the android version 12. 
I hope you got helped by this video. Do not forget to like the video. Thank you so much. I will see you in my next video. Until then, goodbye.